and uh, wanted to give us a, a little bit of an introduction. And Dave, you did a great job on that. We, uh, as David was talking about, we've been with the Marshall uh, Reddick network for over eight years. And I think the most important thing I always like to talk about is that we're the one-stop shop for everybody that uh, we have not only help you guys find your properties investments here in San Antonio, but we can also manage them as well as renovate them if you're looking at investment properties. And we've got some great properties here in San Antonio. We've been the Marshall Reddick uh, San Antonio reps for a while now, so uh, pretty experienced. And it looks like some of you guys that are on it, uh, we've talked and even managed properties for you now. I always like to talk about why, you, why would you like to be in San Antonio, and, and David hit a couple um, key factors. You know, we're the fifth uh, fastest growing city in the nation right now, and our, our area has really been booming. It's not only in the rental market, but just in the investment property for all of our investors. This screen right here is a, a good picture of our river walk. If those of you have not been to San Antonio, please uh, don't hesitate to come. We get a lot of investors coming in for the day. Uh, if you're looking for flying in, we'll pick you up at the airport, take you around San Antonio and show you San Antonio. Uh, we have a lot of investors that come in and, and stay for the weekend or for a couple days. But highly recommend that you know, come visit us here in San Antonio. You'll see uh, what a great city. I always like to talk about, you know, you have your choices as investors of buying places in different parts of the United States, but why would you want to choose San Antonio? Well, I have a couple key factors right here on the screen. Seventh largest city in the United States. People don't realize that San Antonio is one of the largest cities in the United States, but as a couple, couple of the other slides that I'm going to be showing, we're a large city, but with a small town atmosphere. People uh, don't think of San Antonio as a large city. Third fastest growing large city in the nation. Population of over 2 million people. Those of you guys that have not been to San Antonio, never imagine that San Antonio has a population of over 2 million. But I think the biggest thing for you guys as investors is positive cash flow. You are going to see some great multi-units that we have here tonight. And we have a small amount of inventory, so they will go fast. But all of them have positive cash flow. But more important is, most of them, when you're closing, are going to be rented out or just about ready to go rented out when you close in on the property. We have a high demand, or high demand for rental properties. One thing about San Antonio, we have three military bases. We have Randolph Air Force Base. And on these properties that I have tonight, they're minutes away from Randolph. We have Fort Sam Army Base. Fort Sam Army Base has the largest trauma center in the world. And then we have Lackland Air Force Base, which is on the other side of town, about 25 minutes away. Uh, and they have all the pilot training programs out there for the Air Force. We're home to five Fortune 500 companies. And then we have South Texas Medical Center, the only medical research care provider in the South Texas region. Our medical facilities that we have here in San Antonio has brought in a lot of RN jobs as well as doctors, and I think the most important thing right here, and you're going to see these properties tonight, but the most affordable city in America, both those who live and those who visit. We have quite a bit of investors that we manage properties that are coming from California, Chicago, New York, Florida, that are retiring here in San Antonio because you're going to see some properties, fourplex that we have for $450,000, $453,000. They're in California and other states. You'd probably be looking at about $1.5 so the most affordable. But the other thing that our vacancy rate here in the San Antonio market is extremely low. Our company, we're sitting at about 1.5% vacancy rate in San Antonio, and that is with our company. These properties that I'm going to be showing you, we're 100% occupied in all of them. A little bit about our economy, and, and again, why is San Antonio so strong? First, I want to talk about the oil. Um, a few years ago, they found oil outside of the city of San Antonio, so that has brought our rental market extremely high as far as uh, rental. And most of the properties that we have are being rented out in days. We're home to Toyota Manufacturing, HEB headquarters. HEB is one of the single largest companies owned by Charles Budd in the world. They're not in the stock market. They're owned by one person, and their headquarters is here in San Antonio. AT&T, 
Clear Channel Communications, Tesoro. Rackspace is another large company. Rackspace came into San Antonio about five or six years ago. They took the entire mall, purchased it with the city of Windcrest right outside San Antonio, gave them a great tax break, and it's, it's basically brought thousands of jobs. All these properties located minutes away. One of the largest military concentrations in the United States. San Antonio is visited by more than 26 million tourists per year. And as people are coming by here, a lot of them are buying second homes down here and quite a bit of investment properties. I talked about Fort Sam Army Base a little bit earlier, and this is the largest trauma center in the world. Over a $2 billion operation that was uh, started about six years ago and has br brought plenty of RNs and doctors' jobs in there. They do all the wounded warriors when they come in from war and have injuries. This is where they come from. They come straight here to the trauma center at Fort Sam Army Base. You know, I think the most important thing as an investor, you guys have plenty of opportunities to invest anywhere in the United States. But what I take a lot of pride in is we're, we're experienced professionals. I have Jason who's been with me for over 12 years. I've been in the real estate business not only as a broker, but I have been an investor myself. I personally own over 60 properties in the San Antonio market and the surrounding areas. So when you're talking with my company you're, and my clients and my workers here, you're, de you're dealing with people that are investors themselves. So when I'm working with you as an investor, I'm treating each home as, as like my own. The most important thing as an investor is your property management. We manage approximately 900 properties with a vacancy rate of about 1.5, one of the lowest in the city of San Antonio. We do that with because we have a large staff here and we have experienced professionals here in our office. The other thing is, is not only if you're buying brand new, if you're looking for properties that need renovations, I'm a licensed builder as well as a licensed contractor. What that means for you is that if you're looking for a distressed property and you get a great deal on it and we need to renovate it, we can take care of all the needs for you as, a, as an investment. And the big thing on that is any property we can have renovated within five to seven days. Anything that needs to be done to a property, if it needs to replace a roof, ceramic tile, paint it, uh, cabinets, whatever needs to be done, we can do it. We, need to, we can pull permits. Um, there's nothing that we can't do. Again, we're a builder as well. And you as an as investor, when you're property and you're purchasing a property and it needs something to be done to it, time is money. So when you're sitting every day, you're losing anywhere from $30 to $40 a day. If you have this property and it's been rented out for two years and say your tenant moves out, well, we can get this property rented in days. And for us to turn around, we can turn around the property, anything needs to be done to it, in a matter of two to three days, painting, carpet, cleaning. That's so important for you as an investor because you're, you're not losing money on a daily basis. And that goes back to the property management. Not only do we uh, manage uh, multi-units, we, we manage large single-family homes as well. But most of my property managers here in my office and my assistants are family and friends I've known for a long time. So our productivity in our office is extremely important. But the most important thing is the communication to our investors on a daily basis. We're the only property management here in the city that has an office open during the weekends. I have a couple of my staff members working over, over the weekends. And the most important thing is, is making sure that not only are we taking care of our tenants, we're taking care of any investors that are needing uh, items to be done. And when you're looking in South Texas, just an example going back to the property management, is that if you have an air conditioning right now during the day, we're at 100-degree we're at weather. And if it's on a Saturday, most property management companies, what they do is, you know, they go to a voicemail and they get it on Monday. We dispatch AC guys seven days a week. I, I don't care if it's 10 o'clock at night, if it's up to the tenants. Because the most important thing is we are taking care of our tenants. And we're able to do that because we have our own maintenance in-house. Uh, we're one of the only companies here in the city that does that. And what that does for us is that we're taking care of our tenants in a timely manner. We're making sure that they're happy which in return they stay in the property for long term. And as you see on the very last line is can offer newly construction homes as well as multi-units. 
a little bit about San Antonio, some key factors. The fifth largest growing city in the United States. The population, two point, over 2.3 million. New residents, I think that's an important factor right there. Over 43,000 new residents. That's a nice picture of our river walk there. And right below that picture, San Antonio's economy is still riding high thanks in part of the oil boom. That has been a very important part of our rental. And even before that, we were still, our vacancy rate was extremely low. But this has helped individuals, especially these multi-units, plus our military service, to keep our properties at a very low vacancy rate. Our unemployment rate in January was 5.4, more than a percentage point below the national average. Let me repeat that because I think that's extremely important with the way the economy was before. 5.4%, more than a percent point below the national average. San Antonio, when the economy really went down, San Antonio stayed really strong. They, weren't, they didn't take the dip like most places. So we recovered extremely nice, and we're seeing that right now. We're seeing a lot of development going on, a lot of lots being developed, and that, that's important for here in San Antonio. San Antonio is a young city, which is also helping to boost the local population. Remember what I said earlier, San Antonio is a, one of the largest cities, but yet we got that small town atmosphere here in San Antonio. Alamo City B, kind of a little bit of a business boot camp. Home prices in San Antonio are expected to rise 7.6% between the second quarter of 2013 and the second quarter of 2014. And we're seeing that on, on construction. We're seeing prices constantly going up. So it's important. What we have now in 6, 12 months could be anywhere from five to $7,000 more. At 7.6%, San Antonio's forecasted rate of price appreciation is better than the national average. A lot of key factors here in San Antonio compared to the national average, how, how important and how well we're comparing to everyone else in the, in the nation. The report shows that San Antonio is poised to see higher price appreciation than several Texas markets over the same time period. Little article on the CNN money, seven most business-friendly cities. I like that right there, number three, and I kind of touched on it as I'm going through uh, the presentation here. San Antonio, big little city. And if you guys have been to San Antonio, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. You can get around San Antonio in probably about a half hour, 45 minutes compared to other places, California, Chicago, New York, where you're sitting in traffic. San Antonio, they've actually done a great job on the highways and the freeways to stay in, ahead of all the expansion and our increase in population. That's a nice picture in the background of the Alamo. One thing I always like to talk about, and I know Places like California and some of the others are tenant-friendly states, but one of the most important thing is Texas is a landlord-friendly state. Again, going back to property management, I built my business around property management, but we can get a tenant out of our places within 30 days because our court system definitely uh, helps us as landlords, and that's so important, to, especially compared to other places. We do everything in-house with the property management. We go to court. We handle everything. We have a couple of attorneys on our, on our uh, fee as far as if we ever need them, but 99% of the time we do not need our own attorneys because we can handle it in-house. We do bank wires for our investors. We're paperless, so all of your statements, are you can pull them off online or we can scan them to you, and all the money is bank wired to you as an investor every month. Little Forbes article here about San Antonio. Number 11 for best places for business and careers. We're seeing quite a bit of people transferring from other parts of the United States and countries uh, to come to San Antonio. And the reason is, is not only can they uh, get paid well, but they can cost of living is extremely low. So they can buy an extremely nice house 
uh, for their money. Medium home price around the middle, 158700 is a medium home price here in San Antonio. I'd like to share this map uh, always on my webinars is a little bit about San Antonio. And if you see in the upper right corner in, in red, you see Randolph Air Force Base. And then right below that to the left, you see Fort Sam Army Base. Between those two bases, you're looking about 10 minutes apart. Our office sits right in the middle. Most of the multi-units are right around this area, which is about five to seven minutes from all the military bases. So we get quite a bit of military renters. And these four plexes and multi-units I'm going to be showing you this evening is we have quite a bit of civil service, military, RNs, mainly all young professionals in these properties with 100% occupancy rate. On the bottom center is Toyota. Right above that is Lackland Air Force Base. In San Antonio, we have USAA, most of you guys have heard USAA, over 200 acres is where their office is. And they, they pretty much all insurance, you name it, they do it. And I tell you, that is a big company here in San Antonio. We have SeaWorld. We have Fiesta Texas, or Six Flags, so some of you guys may know. But people come to San Antonio, that's why we have over 26 million tourists per year, is because they come to San Antonio to visit SeaWorld or, or Six Flags and see the Alamo Dome, the Riverwalk. Quite a bit of colleges, they're always coming down here, and, and we're getting the Final Fours quite a bit. And I think the other thing is sports. Spurs won their fifth championship in basketball. They're talking about getting a football team here in San Antonio as well. Now, what most of you guys have probably have seen and waiting for is what do we have in San Antonio that you might be interested as an investor, and why would you want? I pointed out all the key factors for you guys uh, as far as why San Antonio and what kind of services that Jason and I here in San Antonio can provide. Well, I'm going to show you the properties that we have that we can provide to you. Keep in mind, these properties, we have one and two of each. And the way it works is as anyone is interested in it, uh, you will go through David. And at, again, the last presentation is through the Marshall Network system. And contact him immediately. And he will put you in touch with us. That's so important is because we, don't, we will not get in a bidding war with our own Marshall Reddit uh, investors. We, we want to make sure you guys are taken care of. Here's the first property. This is a fourplex. This is a newer subdivision located in Selma, which is actually on the outskirts of San Antonio, priced at 453000 That's not a misprint, 453000 for a fourplex. Stucco on the front, stone right below it, each unit is over 1,245 square feet with stained concretes, and I'll have a couple pictures for you in just a little bit. Three bedrooms, two and a half bath. Most of our tenants are military, civil service, RN. We've got a couple VPs. We're uh, right now. We just had a, a, one of our investors close about a week ago. And we have already filled up two of the units, and we have two applications coming in within two weeks, 100% rented out. Projected rent, $4,600. Projected monthly cash flow per month, $915.32. All the appliances are included, 100% rent ready. They have stove. They have a microwave, refrigerator, and dishwasher. This particular subdivision is about four minutes to five minutes from Randolph Air Force Base and about 10 minutes from Fort Sam Army Base. And actually walking distance or riding a bike to Randolph Brooks Credit Union. Randolph Brooks Federal Credit Union is one of the largest individual credit unions uh, in Texas, they have expanded into Dallas, Austin, the Valley, which is South Texas, 
and they are growing leaps and bounds. And this is located basically minutes away from this subdivision. Also, this subdivision, which Shirt Cibolo is right on the outskirts, Amazon, about four minutes away from Amazon. So as you can see, the location of this one is extremely good for anybody that needs to drive on the major highways or come to the major businesses. It's only about five minutes away from the mall shopping and also food outlets, places that you want to buy your groceries, HEB or Walmart. The next subdivision, this picture was taken by Jason just a few days ago. Grass freshly installed and cut. This property right now is just minutes away from the other subdivision, located by Randolph Air Force Base and Fort Sam Army Base. We already have this particular property is 100% finished, and we already have two tenants in place and another two tenants in about two weeks. So this will be fully occupied. This is a property right now that if anyone's interested, it's probably the best one I have out there, finished, and will probably be 100% occupied before you even close. That's what we do as, as a company. That's why we've been with the network for over eight years, is we're providing properties, we're putting renters in place already, and we're managing it. Because we're managing these properties, we're already having them full quite a bit or within a couple weeks from closing. That's the key as your investment is having a very good property management set in place. And that's what we build our business around and that's why we've been with the network so long is because we bring great properties and we're making sure that these properties are very well managed. If you look at this one, projected rent, $4,490 per, per month. Projected monthly cash flow, $902.53. This one is 100% stucco. This property right here, compared to anyone else, it's a cul-de-sac. It's a corner property. Next property is in Wurzbach Metal Subdivision. It's a duplex. This is one that we have already sold. The other ones we have are the brand new construction, just like the other ones. Priced at two hundred forty-five thousand, minutes away. We we only have two left. We did have contact uh, with a couple of investors um, that knew that we were uh, having a webinar with the network, Marshall Network members, and they were supposed to be uh, writing up one of these. So um, right now we do have two. We we'll probably possibly have one before the end of the evening. Uh, but these are brand new construction located near the medical center. Each unit has a three bedroom, two and a half bath, one car garage over 1,245 square feet in the heart of the medical center. Most of the people that we have out there are doctors, lawyers, definitely RNs. They're going through to be a doctor. They're going through their, their residency. Military. I have quite a bit of military owners. They live in one unit. We manage the others. Projected rent, 2300 Projected monthly income, $421.00 and four cents. This right here, all, all three of those that I showed you earlier, this is how the insides look. They're all the same. What's nice is that stained concrete. What does that mean for you as an investor? You don't have to worry about replacing that carpet downstairs in the living room or kitchen area because they're all stained concrete. This is a floor plan that people love as tenants. This is why we're 100% occupied in our buildings. If you look at the first slide to the left, that's the living room, and right behind it is the, is the kitchen. And I look on the top, the characteristics of that ceiling. It has a lot of character. The right picture gives a little bit more view. This, these are large. These are 1,245 square feet. You can't get apartments for this. The kitchen, granite countertops, black appliances. That is the in thing here in San Antonio. But granite countertops in the kitchen. 
And the bottom right corner is a picture of the master. The master has a ceiling fan. And inside the bathrooms have ceramic tile on the floor and also on the showers. Next property we have, it's not a brand new construction, but it is fully rented. This actually, we can walk, we can ride our bike to from our office. It'd be a little long walk, but I'll ride my bike there. Um, priced at $189,900. Built in 2007. Great property, 100% stucco all the way around. Three bedroom, two and a half bath. One car garage. Remember in that map I showed you earlier, Randolph and Fort Sam, about 10 minutes apart. This is right in the center of uh, both of those, right by our office, right in the center. Current rent, 1850. So if you're looking at something ready to go, fully rented, projected monthly cash flow over $311. We manage this property, very easy transition, moving it uh, from this property owner to one of our Marshall Network members. Great location. We're 100% occupied as well in this area. Next slide is uh, Reed. And Reed has been with the network. He's a Marshall Reddick preferred Texas lender. Reed, if you guys don't have a lender and you're not qualified, I tell you, Reed has been one of the best lenders I have ever worked with in my career. Um, most lenders I always look at is, do we have to worry about, are they going to get this done? Reed is on top of it. He doesn't miss his deadline. If you are looking at one of these properties or looking at to get qualified in the near future, call Reed. His information is right there on the screen, and you will not be disappointed. Uh, Reed has uh, been with the network for a long time, and boy, I tell you, he's one of the best lenders I have ever worked with, and I'm proud to uh, be working with him. He makes my job as a real estate broker with the network extremely easy. The most important thing is how to reserve a property. Properties are available on a first-come, first-served basis. We will not get into a bidding war with anyone. As far as the process and the requirements, you know, what we'll do is I'm going to be turning it over to uh, David in a little bit. But what we'll be doing is, is you will be getting in contact with David, with the network, and he will basically get everything going and put you in contact uh, with us when you guys are ready. Um, this way we are all on the same page. Requirements, basically we want to make sure before we write up a property, you have to be qualified. You have to have a lender letter. And the reason is, is because we do not want to take one of these properties off the market if you are not qualified. So if you haven't, I want you to go back. I want you to talk with Reed. Uh, you will get with David on any questions. And David will pass everything over to us. And we will contact you guys immediately. And now I'd like to uh, turn it back over to David. And uh, we will go from there. David, I'm going to turn it back to you now, sir. I appreciate it. Great presentation. Very, very well done. Very informative. And uh, we have some great questions here from a few of our network members uh, for you if you got a second to answer them. So, Absolutely. Um, we have one here. Um, uh, when you sell units, uh, is the price based on the appraisal, or do you set the uh, price independently? All these properties are based on appraisal. Keep in mind, there have been quite a bit of properties sold in the subdivision, so these are what the properties are being appraised at. Fantastic. And then um, for, uh, for your rehab costs, uh, how, how do your rehab costs compare to other contractors? We are actually about 40% cheaper than any contractors out there. Not only are we cheaper, if someone was looking for an investment, a rehab property that needs work on it, but we get the property done probably about 75% faster than anyone else because most renovation companies, they have to sub it out. All my guys are on my payroll, from air conditioning to plumbers to electricians. They all work for me. 
So we can turn a property on a rehab anywhere from three to seven days, depending on the extent of it. And compared to, I've seen companies out there, property manager companies out there, renovation companies taking 60 to 75 days because they're waiting on other people. Awesome, awesome. And then um, what is your overall vacancy rate on the uh, properties that you manage? My overall vacancy rate out of 900 properties is 1.5%, one of the lowest in the city, if not the lowest. Um, and then uh, can you explain uh, what your property management uh, fee structure is? Oh, the, absolutely, and that's, I think, the most important thing. Keep in mind, we've been with the network over eight years. Our management fee structure is we charge 8%. And we give a basically about a 2% discount to our network. These are fees because of you as a Marshall Reddick member. member. Other, property, other, other people that we manage properties for, we charge 10%. So we're charging 8% for the network members, and we charge a $500 leasing fee. And we don't, have any, we don't need any money for escrow or anything else, um, especially like on these new properties. So we keep our fees to where you are basically having nothing out of pocket, nothing in reserves. All right, and then we got one more for you, and it's uh, what's the average uh, time it takes for a property to uh, rent out in San Antonio? Well, I tell you, I, I can't compare myself with any other companies because I've got great property managers and leasing agents and staff members. Um, most of these properties right here, and I'm just going to give an example going back to uh, Tosoro Ridge on the corner lot property. Uh, if someone put this under contract, they close in 30 days. I will have that property, if not already rented out, it'd be rented out within 30 days or less. But on particular properties, we are normally having on fourplexes rented out in 30 days. On single family homes, we are normally having those rented out within a week or two weeks. And the reason is, is because our process, when you are going under contract, we are, our leasing agents are already marketing these properties to get rented out now so that what we do is we let our leasing agents know, hey, we have this property on ABC Apple Street here that's going to be closing in 30 days. Here's what the projected rent out. And so we probably, we, what we do is we put our potential clients with these properties. Our phones are ringing. We're getting anywhere from 20 to 30 to 40 lead, rental leads a day. We use a lot of Zillow. We use a lot of different types of advertising out there uh, to keep our phones ringing, military websites. So we are constantly having phones coming in. The other thing that I really want to talk about, and, and this was so important, is we have our tenants give a 60 days notice. A 60 days notice. Most companies out there are giving 30 days. But what's that important for you as a property management? Remember, I said property management is the key factor for you as an investor, is that our tenants are giving 60 days notice. We are already marking these properties before these tenants leave on an average on each month, 98% of our properties are already rented out to the next tenant when these other tenants move out because of what we do 60 days prior. Our biggest goal or our biggest headache sometimes is being able to get these people moved in and these other people, they're out on the first. We have these other people moving in on the third. For you as an investor, what that means for you is you got two days of lost rent. That's so important to be able to have a good property management company. Fantastic. And then we have a, we have a couple more good ones that just came in here. Um, uh, one here is, uh, is there any incentive for uh, cash buyers? Absolutely. Absolutely. If, there is a, if you're looking at uh, as a cash buyer, uh, definitely get with David. Each property is different, but we normally can knock off about $5,000 right off the top on these on a cash buyer if not more. Fantastic. And then uh, Kevin here uh, asks, um, what the, uh, the military uh, family turnover rate is? You know, and that's a very good question. Um, military are staying anywhere from three to five years now. Uh, in the past, it's, it's been anywhere from two to four, but most of them have been stationed here about three to five years. If they do have to go outside for about six months, they leave their families here. So that is important. I mean, people are always said, oh, well, it's bad because military, because they go. Not, not at all. Mil most military people are staying here for a long time. 
Fantastic. Thank you. A lot of people are uh, asking for the, uh, the taxes and insurance and the financials, and I just want to let everyone know that we can uh, email you guys that so you can have that. Um, and we're going to wrap it up here, and I appreciate all of you guys coming on, and uh, thank you uh, to our team over in San Antonio, Texas, for doing a fantastic job. I hope everyone enjoyed the presentation tonight, and we'll see you on for the next one. I'm a real estate advisor here, David Kling, signing off, and uh, you guys can reach me here on my direct line at 949-885-5160 or shoot me over an email at dkling at mrren.com. Hope everyone has a great, great night. Talk to you later. Bye.